Hey guys and welcome to Cooking with Speedos. I'm back, baby. So today we're gonna be making some schnitzel, aka cutlets, aka uh, resnya in Slovak. Yeah, this is a really proper good meal, good meat. But you've probably been taught how to cook this wrong, and I'm gonna show you the right way to do it, baby. So first things first. <coughs> we're gonna need some ingredients. We're gonna need some eggs. We're gonna need some soft, simple flour. We're gonna need some salt. Eh. And some other stuff that I'll add later that's, bo that's a bonus. Now, normally you would need about two eggs, uh, two spoons of flour, and about one spoon of salt. But, uh, we're working here with one kilogram of meat. If it was a half a kilogram, I would have the ingredients I just talked about, but since we have double the portion of eat meat, we're gonna double everything, including the good stuff. <laughs> so we start out by cutting up all the meat. And I should mention, this meat is boneless and skinless, which is the best, that gives the best results. But, uh, you know, you can work with what you have. Now, the meat has been cut up into considerable chunks, about the size of your thumb. And now what we're gonna do is simply salt it all, just salt the hell out of it. Keep turning it around, whoop, whoop, and salt in some more. Ah, now that all of the meat has been cut up, it's time to make the dough mix. Let's start with the eggs. Whisk it up. Okay, mix is done. As I said, this is a double dose, so we're adding one normal teaspoon of salt. Normally it would be half a teaspoon, or less. And about four teaspoons of flour. So one, eh, two, eh, three, and four. And now we can do the proper mixing. This is a lot of flour right now. So, we're gonna add the Speedo's secret ingredient now. That This is what you've been waiting for. When it comes to the secret ingredient, you have three options from which you can choose. Baking powder, milk, or a beer. <laughs> you already know which one I'm gonna choose. And the trick here is to have a good balance of the substance. If it's too watery, you add more flour. If it's the exact opposite, you add more milk or beer if you want, but you know, some milk doesn't, doesn't hurt it. So we keep mixing this until it's a good, nice, holding together mix. As you can see right now, this is way too watery, so I'm gonna add some more flour. There we go. I actually ended up adding two more uh, spoons of flour, and as you can look at it now, it's kind of creamy, kind of watery, holds together. That's the kind of substance we want for this meat. Now, you're gonna have to get your pan started, so we're gonna get some oil. Keep the pan up. Oh, hell yeah. And now, a couple bonus ingredients you might wanna add. Bonus ingredient number one. Vegeta. This is his final form. We are gonna add just a tiny tiny bit of this, maybe like one drop, you know? Ooh, that doesn't look bad at all, hey <laughs> hey. I'd say about one drop of this, like, yeah, there we go, that's about it. Bonus ingredient number two, sesame seeds. We're gonna add about one teaspoon of these, drop them in, and let's get to mixing. Hell yeah, baby! We're making the ultimate meal! Ah, oh, yeah! This is how I have sex. Look at that delicious mix. <laughs> Finally, we're gonna put these two together. The meat and the mix. We're gonna start slowly dropping the meat in, you know? about five or six pieces at a time and start mixing it up a little bit my fingers are fucking 
You know the mix is good when it's kind of watery, but still sticks to your meat. This is the kind of mix we want. And now we just drop it in a pan. Whoops. <laughs> and now once the oil is hot, we just take it and drop it in a pan. And just let them cook and turn them around when you need to. Ooh, now that's going well, see? The trick is, you gotta put it on when it's on high heat and then lower the heat so it just stays even the whole time. Look at that! As a side dish, I'm boiling a bunch of potatoes. I'm gonna peel them when they're done. Hey, 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 Well, well, well. It's time to eat. <laughs> This has been Cooking with Speedos. <laughs>